the humans and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Charlie and I make alternative makeup and music content. So in today's video, I have a very special guest with me, my friend Tia. Uh, they also have a TikTok and a YouTube channel, so their links will be in the description down below and you can go give them a follow. Uh, and our collab will also be on their channel if you want to go check it out. I highly recommend. Uh, for our video today, we are going to be copying each other's makeup. We hey. both <laughs> We both have like pretty similar makeup styles, so we're gonna be doing a fun little, I don't know, emo shit. Emo shit. <laughs> An emo shit challenge. Is challenge still an okay word to use on YouTube? I think so. Was that 2015? It might have been. It may have been. You know what? You sh they'll, they'll explain what we're doing. <laughs> okay, so I came up with this idea that we get our base makeup already done, which you can see, and one of us will take a turn of doing a part of our face and the other person has to recreate that either with what they exactly see or kind of in their own style. So it's it's very open to choices. Yeah, so they'll do something, I'll copy it, I'll do something, they'll copy it back and forth until our face is done and we hopefully look okay. Because we're going to be filming TikToks. We should probably so. pray. Yeah, we'll <laughs> Please, Satan. Please, Satan. Oh, Lucifer, save us. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna do rock, paper, scissors to see who goes first. Do you wanna do like one game with us out of three? Or? Best out of three. Okay. Unless you shoot, because I like to shoot. Yeah. Okay. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. One. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Two. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Okay, you have to go first. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> this is not what I'm hoping for because uh, I don't have any ideas I was hoping I could just steal mine but now it's too late <laughs> I'm not trying to look like Santa from Little Helper <laughs> that sounded weirdly sexual I'm sorry eeny meeny miny mo catch a tiger by the toe if he hollers let him go eeny meeny miny mo Fuck! Green! You're gonna be Santa's little helper. I'm gonna be Santa's little helper. Also sponsored by James Chinook. <laughs> As you can see, Fly us to LA. Are you sure we're recording? Yeah. <laughs> okay, um, probably like two, three minutes in and now we're finally getting to doing makeup. Let's see how this goes. Oh, that's pretty. I was on the zooming side. That was traumatizing. Okay. We're going with green. Okay, is that good as like the first step? Yeah, that looks pretty good. And it's good to like leave that little like crease there. Yeah, I always like leave that. Okay, and I'll just do the other eye. I'll probably leave this eye off camera unless yeah. Tia says something funny. No pressure. The only poem you're gonna do a time moment. I'm a clown. Okay, so this is the first step. Um, I'm not gonna make a joke, but you're all thinking it. You now have to copy this. I don't think I understand my task. It's a pretty simple one, I won't lie. Thank God my hair is not black anymore because that would look a little bit strange. I have some bad news for you. What? <laughs> you look strange anyway. I'm being bullied. <laughs> <laughs> or I first go in by darkening the green. The I'm going in with the shade Daddy. <laughs> And it is the darker green. 
Unleash your inner artist. Unleash your inner kinks, <laughs> <laughs> This is a very dusty color. I feel like you've never used this. Not a lot, no. I haven't really used any of the greens. Uh, but also, these are pressed pigments, not eyeshadows, so they're pretty dusty. Oh, they are pressed. That's what makes them so bright. That makes so much more sense. I am also pressed. Oh, there's green in my hand. Uh, what happens when the green just decides to fall out onto my perfect leaf? Okay, so actually, life tips for makeup with Charlie. When you do your base first and you have really, really, really pale skin. When you put your eyeshadow on, a lot of fallout is probably going to get on your under eye and on your cheeks. Uh, to fix that problem, either you can put on a bunch of setting powder beforehand and then brush it off. Or you can take a little bit of white eyeshadow or like a really light shadow if your skin's a bit darker. Um and just kind of brush off as much of the fallout as you can and then reapply a little bit of concealer and it should fix the problem. Although honestly, I usually don't have to take off a lot of the fallout because I tend to make looks that get all really messy around the under eye area anyway, like on purpose. All right, now you have to copy how I made this look a little bit more defined. Next, I like putting my brush in here so that the dark colors don't get on the light ones. Fair. For the camera people, camera people, audience, followers, watchers, viewers, viewers, that's the word I was looking for. Viewers. I'll, I just took a brush that was, um, had copious amounts of black eyeshadow on it, slapped it a little bit, uh, like Bob Ross did with his paintbrushes, and then just dipped it in this one so that the black won't get in the green. I don't recommend. I swear we all, we sound like we hate each other by like blaming each other on hope. We're friends. We're friends, okay. <laughs> just just yeah. You will have a lot of like some stuff that will sound abusive, but it's not. It's not. I don't actually think they're one foot tall. What? They're two. Ah! <laughs> okay, now I need to do something that Tia will need to copy. Okay, so I'm gonna flow my lid. First I'm gonna take some concealer and a little brush. And then I'm gonna put some shiny shit on it. And then Tia will have to do the same thing. Shiny shit's a technical term. I feel like I'm doing this all, all wrong, but hopefully Charlie can put it together that it will look like a nice amateur first video. Okay, everyone's first video is done all wrong. Mm, fair. My first videos are private and in the depths of hell. I don't think I'll be taking stuff away this day, though. Because this is like an actual proper setup, and I have no setup at home. <laughs> yeah, my first video was like an intro to my channel that I never I never used that. Channel. Yeah. Um, but it was like, you know, this channel's gonna be like alternative stuff that's inspired by Gansville and Johnny Gilbert. Um, my makeup was shit as I was 12. It was a whole thing. Concealer always smells very chemical. <laughs> I don't even know how to explain it. It just smells chemical.
Okay, so you're just like doing the concealer on your lid right now? Yeah. So while you do that, just because I have my concealer on already, I'm just gonna put on like the shiny stuff. Yes. And then you can put on the shiny stuff. Shiny. Shiny? <laughs> okay. Um, you need to do the next step. Alright. And I choose eyeliner. So we're going to go off first with just basic wings. I don't know what direction they're going to go in, but I'm going to choose just basic wings. And then after Charlie has completed that step, um, maybe you can add on to the eyeliner. It's like maybe the eyeliner is different or like, I don't know. Did you figure something out? I'm going to start. Got sucked into the frat boy messiness. Messiness, I can't speak. Moonweed was talking about the metalhead to frat boy pipeline. Yes, we did. It could happen to you. It could happen to your son. It could happen to your brother. It could happen to your child. They go into the depths of being white, even if they aren't. I can't see what they're doing. I'm scared. You guys can probably see what they're doing. I don't know what's happening. Right now, I am just going in with kind of more of a straight eyeliner. If you need to use my eyeliner, you can. Um, also, I should just talk quickly uh, for the version of this video on my channel. Um, it has been, I think, five weeks since I uploaded. Maybe six. One month. Um, Probably. Yeah, I haven't said anything on here or explained why that is, so I, th I figured maybe you people deserve an explanation. Uh, I just started a part-time job and it's kicking my ass. Um, I'm exhausted all the time. I have had no ideas. I want to film a base cover for I Wanna Be Your Slave by Mona Skin. Someone asked for that, but I haven't had the time to learn the base part. So I've just been procrastinating on filming anything. Um, but I'm hoping now that I have some of my sanity and motivation and humanity back, um, I'll be able to film more consistently for this channel because I really like posting here. Uh, you guys are great. I just am depressed. This is the first. This is what we're doing. Oh, okay. I like that. This is two different eye looks, and you know what? That's okay. It's okay that they're not sisters or twins or cousins. Or living on the same continent. It's okay. okay. Okay, so we had an issue. We were using Charlie's phone to record, and when I went upstairs to take a break, um, 
Charlie must have seen that their phone had died. So we're using my iPhone right now. Um, we're charging their phone. We hope that we didn't lose a lot of footage. Yeah. Because we... <laughs> this is currently where we're at, though. This yeah, is currently this where, is we're at. where we're at now. We don't know how much we lost. Mm -hmm. Hopefully it wasn't that much. Yeah. Um, but basically we're just gonna base, I think all we have left to do is like, if we wanted to add something extra, we can, but we have like the lips mainly. Yeah. I don't know how much footage we lost, but we left off. I had just done like the, mas mas <sighs> fucking Christ. When we left off, I had just done like the mascara dots and Tia copied that. So now they're going to do like lips. So I'm just basically going to just fill my lips black, but I'm planning on doing like Kind of a spiked outer corner of the lip. Right, okay. As you can see, that's very dark. And I'm just gonna be copying what they're doing with my black cat liquid lipstick from Pretty Zombie Cosmetics. I brag about it in all of my videos. This one, honestly, um, Black Radiance did a good job with the pigment and how it can stay on if you sweat, it stays on, but if you start eating something that's hot, it tends to fall off because the only way to really get rid of this lip stick is to use Vaseline or use hot water. So anything that is hot or oily, we'll take this off in minutes, actually seconds. So I normally take this off before I eat something hot, unless I'm just eating like a snack, I'm fine. Okay, you know that ICP song that's like trending on TikTok right now? It's like, it should only exist in the dark of my room. Oh, whatever. yeah. What is that song about? I can't figure it out. Is uh, it like, he's fucking a corpse? Or he thinks he's fucking someone that's not there? Or like, um, what's going on? Okay, so I kind of researched that because I was also concerned. Um, it's about, uh, it's actually not about anyone to do with the band ICP. Mm -hmm. It's... I don't know if this is false information, but this is what I heard. Mm -hmm. um, apparently, um, there was a person, this is a story that they had heard, and they thought, oh, this would be a really good song to like, or this would be a good idea for a song. Mm -hmm. And um, there's this story that they read, or they were told as a kid or something, I don't know, some sort of scary perverted story. Because a lot of the ICP members have a lot of history with abuse. Um, and basically, um, one of the members, I don't know which one, um, was told as a kid by someone who's a little bit messed up in the head that, um, sometimes on Halloween you'll be treated with a very attractive ghost and this ghost girl will come and please you in the night. So it's kind of like... A really screwed up song but it's kind of has a point to like this is what this child who's in the band had to live with for the rest of his life knowing that someone had told him that and when he was old enough to realize that that was a lie he realized how screwed up that was for a kid to hear yeah so, so it is about fucking a ghost yes I thought it was about fucking a corpse but then the line she's gone didn't make any sense Mm. If it was a corpse. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, why is she gone? Where did she go? <laughs> I'm very... I don't approve of fucking corpses. Just to be clear. I know I seem very nonchalant about that. Um, I listen to Avenged Sevenfold. So if you know Avenged Sevenfold, that should tell you all you need to know. And here is the completed look. I feel like we both ended up with something pretty different, but it sort of matches. Yeah. I could see us as like evil twins in a movie. And yeah. And our makeup's a little different so you can tell us apart. Yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, this is the look. I had a lot of fun filming this video. Um, so did I. This is very fun. Yeah. If you guys liked having tea on the channel, please let me know in the comments. I will bring them back. I'll bring them back even if you didn't like them. Fuck you. But yeah. Please let me know if you did like seeing them because that'd be great. Anyway, thank you for watching. Uh, I hope you enjoyed. If you did enjoy, you can leave a like down below and subscribe to see more from me. You can also follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok, all of which will be linked in the description down below. 
Uh, you can check out a playlist of my other makeup videos in the description down below or linked on the i somewhere on screen now. As I said before, Tia's links will also be in the description so you can go follow them. And yeah, with all that being said, once again, thank you so much for watching. I hope you have an absolutely fantastic day and I can't wait to see you again soon. Bye!